So, race 15 and race 2 on day 2 is the Ladbrokes Dublin. Steeplechase is a great one event, the big race of the day. Over two miles and a furlong. As we wait for the runners. Here they come. So, number 1 is Adrenaline for Leon Van Rensburg. 2 is Alpine Hideaway for Craig Allen. 3 is Spice Motts for David Robertson. 4 the King for Joshua Sutherland. 5 Alien Invasion for Leon Van Rensburg. 6 is Cash's Queen for David Hooley. 7 is Dazed Valley Dance for Darren Thompson. 8 is Heracleon for Stu Gray. 9 is Lassania Stellina. Craig Beckwith, known front runner. Ozark Zetkin for Vinnie Gerard is 10. Relative Rose for Craig Allen is 11. The Smiler for Josh Sutherland is 12. And to the stars of David Hooley makes up 13. Challenge for this grade one, the Labrooks Dublin steeplechase. Flags raised. They're racing. Is Massinia Stellina that's going to lead them over the first? We'll take that quite well, and it is Massinia Stellina that's going to lead us. We go past the grandstand. And through the first couple of furlongs. Go past the winning post. Shortly, Samia Sterling is going to lead them. Let's a quick look round the jockey. He's got a five-length advantage. From Alien Invasion, the Smiler, the King, the Spice Mots, and Relative Rose together. And we've got a length and a half back to a second chasing pack. It's being led by Adrenaline and wide is Cash's Queen, I think. And two of the stars up against the fence is Alpine Hideaway. We've just followed through by Ozark Zetkin, Day's Belly Dancer. Get to the big open ditch and Heraklion just bringing up the rear. So it's Lassania Stellina that leads us into the third. Oh, and he took a dive in it and he's gone. Oh, just there's two gone there. I think he may well have taken down Ozark Zetkin as well. So that leader's gone. Moose Horse is still there. And so Ozark Zetkin for Vinnie Gerard's gone. Unlucky in the last game, the Hawks disqualified. They'll be able to follow up with this as they get to the fourth. And they'll take that one well. Being led now by Alien Invasion for Leon Van Rensburg. Although reluctantly, he's also got a loose horse in front of him that may cause a few problems as he comes to the next. Spice Mots, as they get to this one, it's a plain one. They will, oh, no, they will get over that. It's that loose horse at the rear. So we're being led by uh, a loose horse, and then we've got Alien Invasion, Alpine Hideaway, it's a plain one. You get over that well. So there you're one, two, then Spice Mots is in third, then the Joshua Sutherland horses, the Smiler and the King are together. And the three of relative Rose Days, Bally Dancer and Adrenaline. And a length and a half back to the David Hooley horses, to the stars and Cash's Queen. As they go over the seventh, and just at the rear is Heraklion. A little bit of a mistake as he went over it towards the end. So it's a bit of change up front again as they come to the next. We're inside the final mile. It's all fairly tactical. Leaders are over it and take it well. The one that's taken out now is the king with alien invasion on his inside. Still getting in trouble with the loose horse. But it's the king that leads us from alien invasion. Relative Rose, Spice Mots, and Alpine Hideaway. The Smiler to the stars is wide. Cash's Queen's got nowhere to go. And then you've got Adrenaline and Day's Valley Dancer being pushed along. We've lost sight of Heraklion. As they approach the next, which is the ninth. Which is three from home. They're all over it. Bit of a mistake at the rear by Adrenaline. But we're still being led by the King. So we swing left handed now, along straight to the finish. And it's the King that leads, relative Rose in second. Leaders are all over that, even Heraklion as well at the rear. But it's the King being chased up now by the To the Stars in second. They're a couple of lengths away from Alien Invasion that's uh, slowed up a little bit. Cash's Queen is on the wide outside, but up front is the King and To the Stars. We come down to the final two furlongs and just one to jump, and it's the To the Stars that takes it up. David Hooley from the King gets over it well, and they've got a two furlongs to run on the flat, and it's To the Stars that leads. By length and a half from the King, Alien Invasion starting to move up once, going back with his Cash's Queen, but they've got to catch this To the Stars inside the final furlong. To the stars from the king. Here comes Alien Invasion running on well. Relative Rose and Alpine Hideaway. But David Hoolish to the stars is holding on inside the final half. The king's going to come inside him. The king takes it up. The king takes that up now from Alien Invasion. The king that takes it. Timed well by Josh Sutherland's horse there. The king takes the Labrooks Dublin. Grade 1 steeplechase here. From David Hoolish to the stars. Alien Invasion for Leon Van Rensburg just getting up. May well have got up for second. He does. Takes it from two of the stars. Two Craig Allen horses running on well for fourth and fifth there. Alpine Hideaway and Relative Rose. But it's the King for Joshua Sutton. Another grade one.
admits that his bars are all rubbish and they still win everything. But Alien Invasion for the Unread Medbow was second. To the Stars, David Hugh was third. Alpine Hideaway and Relative Rosemead at fourth and fifth for Craig Allen.